because the mom, son, and pet RV adventures. And this is our RV that we bought, and we're fixing it up to Hi. go on a trip. This is Christian, my son. And this is the RV that we bought. And we have been spending a Shut couple of up. days here. And this is Muffin, one of our pets. The other one is under the truck. Is under the truck. Right now we're parked at our home. We have a side lot that we have our RV parked, and we're practicing um, to do this. I'm a single mom, and I have no clue what I'm doing, but I'm figuring it out. So right now we've had all our stuff organized in the RV. We plan on renting our home because we have a very beautiful waterfront property that's very expensive and, to maintain. And, and me and my mom are planning to take the rug out. Yeah, we'll get to that in a second question. So uh, Christian and I are planning on taking one year off. And right now we are setting up. So um, I'll show you around. And me and Christian have been doing this by ourselves for a few weeks now. And that's my bedroom. This my is a Class C motor home. It's a 1996 Winnebago Itasca. And um, it's in wonderful condition. It's only got about 31,000 miles. It's been raining for about five days now. And the roof doesn't leak. Um, except I had a little bit of a problem in the bathroom shower because uh, one of the overhead vents is a little cracked. So I'll take care of that this week. Up here, um, this is going to be Christian's area where he can have some time to himself. Um, I had my mom make me some really nice curtains for it to keep the light out and I put some pillows up here for him to hang out. Now Christian is, have, have been homeschooling Christian since October it's and the case schools that he was going to um, were I'm not being nice. Yeah, so I decided to homeschool him as a single mom. I do work at home so I'll be taking my work on the road with me because on the strip. So this is a little, great little area for him to do his journaling. We can read books. Uh, he has an overnight bin over here. I'm ready. Then over here is our cab, and I kind of have it covered with some curtains because we get a lot of sunlight here. Um, so I have to figure out how we're going to do this. I don't like the cab to show during the night. I want it to look more like a cozy home. And I'm moving from basically 2,700 square feet to, what, 270 square feet or so. Um, so, yeah, it's it's... It's, it's been a real challenge for me to try to get everything in. So anyway, here is, um, this is our area here. And the, um, the little signs that I put here, family, and then I put home here is just to remind us that this is what it's about. It's about memories, it's about family, it's about feeling home and cozy. And over so here we have the dinette. Um, we have our sofa over here, which turns into a bed. This is Christian. And this is our cat, Mew Mew who we got about a year ago. He just turned a year old and he has not enjoyed the RV when it's in motion. So, um, but we are getting him used to being in here. He, he does enjoy coming in here. We have his food in here. Um, we're in here a lot of the time, so he does spend a lot of time under the RV. Even in the rainy and days. And the hardest problem with him was going to be um, having to keep him on a leash when he goes out because he'll stand in front of the door and he'll want to get out. Yes. So that'll be something to stay before. tuned for um, so that's where he's going to eat now and um, we have this little thing here because we are not hooked up to water yet um, and this is just some stuff that I can get done but we're not hooked up to water yet so this is where I keep his bowl for eating because Muffin will most likely eat his food if it's on the floor so I have <laughs> to keep the cat's food on a counter and I don't really have another and counter so I'm going to figure out how to um, get a counter place for him, maybe in the dash or something like that. So we'll figure that out. So anyway, I bought a little toaster oven. I bought a burner and um, my magic bullets over there. Okay, this is a uh, this is our um, refrigerator here, and, and we have a regular refrigerator. This is not a propane refrigerator, so I'm going to have to figure out um, every, how we're going to be able to. Um, work this we might have to get solar power for it and, and we have two battery coach bat we have two and every time when like when we like turn turn it like to five minutes it's, it's gonna have ice in the back yeah we're getting a lot of um, build up of ice in the back but so right now I'm in the process of um, removing if you look back there I didn't have a good pantry so I had to add this and this is all the stuff that I had in the house so I put it here and this is all my grains so um, right now my shower this is where I had a leak, but this morning I decided to pull out the rug because vinyl, uh, vinyl wood looking 
floors yesterday that were on sale. And they have paper glue. And they have glue on the bottom. So I'll be ripping out the carpet this weekend and putting that in. So but that, but the big problem is about the rug that's so tight. Yeah, that now we need I, yeah. like a man to do it. Well, we'll, we'll do it ourselves, Christian. We don't have a man to do it. So I started, I put up a wall border and I put up some nice pictures and my mom helped me make some curtains, little valances. Um, the blinds are in really good condition and um, we got really good space. This is a great space for me to just be by myself. Here is this where, where you would put a TV, you would show them how they fold that down. So I have to figure out how I can get, um, so we have right now I don't know if I want to go to the expense of getting a new TV. So we might just be putting, in, no Christian, it's all, you bent it the wrong way. We had an incident over there. Moving on. So anyway, this to that? put the house up for rent today because we've been trying to sell it by owner for the last couple of months and you know and people have just been coming here lowballing us ridiculous prices. We had the house appraised about um, little about two months ago and the prices that are coming in are outrageous. Uh, we have an appraisal that was done and w I'm not ready to let it, let it go for anything like that. So I'm just going to rent it and you know and maybe come and back in a year and try to sell it then. So um, either way we trust God. We believe in him that he is going to take us along this journey and we're hoping that you can join us. Say bye Muffin. What about you? Hi everyone this is me um, my mother's son and I'm going to show you my mother's room. Well, before you used to have a carpet. Well, now look at this new idea. I'm now I'm gonna scan, scan, show it really slow. Well, usually you say, "Hey, it must be on the ground." Well, it is on the ground, and you see like the tile over here. Well, they put. Well, they put the towel first. Here's the corner. Well, well, my, well, my mom, she just, she just um, took the rug out, just like like an hour ago. And here's the bed sheet. And here's the other side. And this is the blade that she used. Right there. And the ground, and I said to her, "Wow, the top! Wow, the wood looks kind of good." Okay, this is Christian name signing up. Sign. said mama because we call my dog named well her real name is muffin but we call her mama just like you mama get it <laughs> okay, we're the two mamas me and muffin we're the two mamas right hi um i'm her son and now um i think we should show you outside what do you think mom I just need some help with that. Alright, turn that off and let's get the, let's go do the stuff. Let's go take, let's. Here's our RV. You gotta walk slow, honey, that's too fast. Turn around so we can show where the park is that we're at. Look how pretty this place is. This okay. park is named Sun and Fun. And you see that RV? You can zoom in on the truck now. That's ours. And Yumi's in there with the air conditioner. Yeah, and he's licking himself. There's a, this place is really quiet and really friendly. 
And and if you're watching this, I hope you remove around here or okay, take a trip. Off, no, see ya, see ya next time. Thank you.